Alright guys, what's up? We are out here at the DIY spot. Last time we made a video here and installed a parking curb, so if you haven't seen that video, go back and watch it. But I'm out here today. Kobe had been hitting me up to paint some graffiti at this spot, so that's what we're doing today. If you can't tell, I am sick as a dog. I have a cold. My missus was sick, and then now I'm sick, so it's my turn to suffer. But I definitely just wanted to get out of the house today and uh, make a video for you guys, because I want to get back on this YouTube thing. So yeah, let's meet up with the homie, get into the spot, and get painting. Back out here, looks like the parking curb had been skated a fair bit. That's where you want me to paint, yeah, on top of the... Cool. Yeah, I drew this piece really fucking big, so, <laughs> so I have to like mini it down i probably brought too much paint but it's better to have more paint than uh, less so i feel like i'm gonna utilize that whole spot i might hit the corners maybe we'll see been a minute since i painted but uh i've got nothing but time today so i'm just gonna take my time and get this piece sketched up i brought my gopro as well so be able to get some pretty cool pov shots some action shots so i bought a bunch of paint i even bought roller paint that's a green if there's anything you want to paint green i've got like a whole tub and a roller Oh, some gloves, some Beltons my missus got me for Christmas, and some other colors, but check out the Home Depot bucket, every graffiti writer around the world knows that like, Home Depot buckets are the shit to carry paint in. <laughs> so this is a sketch right here, um, it is six letters, so I've just got to mini it down to fit in that space there, shrubs, that's a homie's uh, company, so I'm going to put a nice little shrubs piece here. Anytime I do like graffiti videos, there's always people telling me how to, you know, oh, graffiti, there's rules, you have to do this and it should be this way. It's like, I, I wrote graffiti my whole life growing up. Like I can go out and paint it and stuff, but I'm not trying to be like Mr. Graffiti Writer anymore. So I don't, I don't really care that you can leave a comment. I don't mind. It's probably better that you do leave a comment, <laughs> honestly, for engagement. S-H-R-U-B-S. S-H-R. So we'll put the R in here. <laughs> Thank you though. Just watch out for cops, dude. <laughs> I doubt there'll be any. We're doing mini pieces out here. deciding if I should throw arrows on through here take out this space on either end I don't know I feel like if I throw an arrow through the corner you're really going to see the line whereas it goes kind of like this and then this and it might look awkward because it's kind of folding and uh, scratch the arrows Dusty. Montana is so dusty.
think that's probably it. I don't want to keep tweaking it and tweaking it and tweaking it because it is quite a simple small piece. So I feel like that pretty much does the job there. Took out that entire space. Looks good to me. Bodies. My bro got put to sleep for life, it's like the mattress got him And free milky brother always kept that hatchet on him I swear that all my mates been dying, I've been locked away The police tried to get me too, my brother not today Bro call me Mr. Clean, my sprite mixed with that Listerine huh? I'm making history, so tap in for you missing me huh? And rip to Dougie, wish my boy could run these hits with me huh? These people judge ya even if they never got to know ya Your favourite rapper probably just a poxy little poser I, I was eating oxy nightly till it made me throw up at, at the trap house pushing packs out where I'd usually post up I'm trying to get my ass to work, the trap just isn't working I used to rob like every cunt, now I'm a different person I sit at night and wonder bro, like was this even worth it? I keep on dreaming about the cunts who want me where the dirt is I used to have a lot more mates but I had to desert them Probably easier in the daytime than the nighttime. Yep. <laughs> Ooh. Hell yeah. So the piece is done. I'm dipping out now with my Home Depot goodies bucket. I am running on empty, like this cold is kicking my ass. I recently had a flu shot too, so I don't know if that accounts to helping fight off the common cold. I don't know, but you can even hear it in my voice. I don't usually sound like this. It sounds husky as, oh, I'm so tired. It's about time for that, some of that day quill. You can only have it like four hours at a time. So I've been waiting <laughs> to sip some day quill. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If it's your first time here on the channel, Make sure you subscribe, drop a thumbs up, leave me a comment. I'm still currently sick, trying to beat this thing. I've lost my sense of smell and can kind of still taste, but it's hard to breathe out my nose. Headaches, fever, so yeah. If you haven't checked out Evening Mob yet, head on over to eveningmob.com, pick up a t-shirt, pick up a hat. Things on sale right now, hats, t-shirts, sunglasses are all on sale. Check out Evening Mob on Instagram, at Evening Mob. Follow me on Instagram as well, at Enochism, and yeah. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching this far, if you've watched it this far. And uh, yeah, wish me luck on this sickness. I'll see you guys in the next video. Red, I want you to go to his house. Blow that joint up, don't let nobody out. Oh, get Trigger Man, bring him to me. Cause I'm tired of this Trigger Man stuff in Tennessee. Now all the time while this stuff is going on, I called up another roadie on my flip phone. Junior, I want you to call down the Texas. Special order me a make.